so you didn't kneel during the anthem, but you also didn't wear a Black Lives Matter shirt. Uh, do you believe that Black Lives Matter? Absolutely. I believe that Black Lives Matter. Um, a, lot, a lot went into my decision, and, and part of it is, first off, um, it, it is, is my thought that you know kneeling or wearing a Black Lives Matter t-shirt um, don't go hand in hand with supporting Black Lives. And so um, I felt like just me personally, um, and what it is that I believe in standing on a stance that um, I do believe that Black Lives Matter, but I, I just felt like it was a decision that I had to make and, and I, I didn't um, you know, feel like putting, putting that shirt on and, and kneeling uh, went hand in hand with um, supporting Black Lives. So that it, if it made me support Black Lives or not, I believe that um, for myself, my, my, my life has been supported um, through the gospel Jesus Christ and, and that everyone is made in the image of God and that we all foreshow of God's glory and that uh, you know each and every one of us each and every day do things that we shouldn't do we say things that we shouldn't say uh, we hate and we, we dislike people that we shouldn't hate and dislike um, and, and sometimes it gets into a point where we point fingers about whose evil is worse and, and sometimes that comes down to simply whose evil is, is most visible so um, I felt like I wanted to just take a stand on like we all make mistakes, but I think the, the gospel of Jesus Christ is that there's grace for us and that Jesus came and died for our sins and that if we all will come to an understanding of that and understand that God wants to have a relationship with us, um, that we can get past skin color, we can get past all the things in our world that are messed up, jacked up. Um, I think when you look around, racism isn't the only thing that, that, that plagues our society, um, that plagues our nation, that plagues our world. And I feel like you know, coming together on that message that we want to get past not only racism but everything that that, 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 that plagues us as a society i feel like the answer to it is is the gospel if I may answer that Sorry, go ahead oh am i able to follow up with a quick one yes please do go ahead okay um so jonathan i i'm asking this with all sincerity i just want to really understand your reasoning for that can you just explain further what you feel like religion has to do with kneeling for the anthem to protest against racism and police brutality? The correlation between those two? Well, I mean, honest, honestly, I don't, I don't really see it as religion for myself. Um, I see it as a relationship with, with God. Um, um, through, through his son who died for our sins, I feel like not only, I, I, don't, I don't think that, you know, kneeling or um, putting on a t-shirt for me personally is the answer. I feel like, um, for me, black lives are supported through the gospel. All lives are supported through the gospel that we all, like I said, have things that, 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 that we do our own. And um, sometimes it gets into a place of pointing fingers about which wrong is worse and, and who's wrong is seen. So I feel like the Bible tells us that we're all, we all fall short of glory. Of the, we all fall short of God's glory. And that at the end of the day, you know, whoever will humble themselves and, and seek God and repent of their sins, that, that, that we could see it in a different light, see our mistakes, see people's mistakes in a different light, or see people's evil in a different light, and that it would help bring us closer together and get past skin color, get past anything that, you know, that's on the surface, doesn't really deal with the hearts of men and women.